Tributes outside court for a young father whose life was taken too soon. Tommy Rake is missed every day and he's loved by so many people. Mr Rake was working in a roadside traffic crew in Carrum Downs when he was hit by a speeding car travelling 60 kilometres over the limit. He suffered horrific injuries and died at the scene. The man responsible, Jason Rusco, fled, leaving his crumpled car and Mr Rake to die on the road. His colleague, Sean Kilmartin, narrowly avoided death, suffering a broken leg. The county court heard in the lead-up to the crash, Rusco had been seen driving dangerously and swerving between lanes. It is shameful conduct that is difficult to comprehend, Judge Robin Harper said. You drove at excessive speed and displayed gross inattention. The judge said Rusco had an appalling driving record and had received a community corrections order just 10 days before the fatal crash. To this day, he's yet to express any remorse or apologise to the victim's family. Outside court, supporters of the killer driver lashed out. He doesn't get to experience the loss that we've had, the heartbreak that we have, that we still go through. Mr Rake's death prompted an outpouring of grief from members from his industry who held a motorcade in his honour, pleading with road users to be mindful of worker safety. I want to thank the Victorian police, the first aid responders, the public that were there on the day that assisted, um, and just the support that we still get from everybody. Rusco pleaded guilty to culpable driving and was today sentenced to 16 and a half years jail. The earliest he could be released is 2032. Christian Silva, ABC News, Melbourne.